Big news coming out of Detroit. The East Jefferson Corridor is getting a new Meyer grocery store. Yeah, the Meyer store will be part of the Rivertown Market. Let's get on over to our Rob Maloney. He joins us now live this afternoon. Rob, this is a really big deal for Detroit. Yeah, you know, uh, Everard, welcome to the greening of Detroit Park. I've driven by it a thousand times. Didn't know that was the name, but that's what they call it here. And if you look behind me here, you can see the construction for the Rivertown Market. And it's going to be a Meyer small concept. Now, we all know that Myers tend to be these sprawling expanses taking up a couple of city blocks. That's not going to be the case there. They've, they've gone to a much smaller sort of urban concept, and that's what they plan on opening up here. And of course, Detroit has long lamented the fact that you really can't buy groceries in the city. Now, yes, the Eight Mile and Woodward store, the old Roseville High School, they have Myers there. They've been there for a few years now. Uh, but on the east side, it's been essentially a food desert. And so there is excitement here to see the fact that there's going to be a Myers store here, 60 employees, 100 parking spots, and fresh food, groceries here in the city of Detroit, right across from Rivertown here on East Jefferson. Let's hear from what they had to say when they were discussing it today at their press conference. And today, we are so very excited to continue our investment in the city of Detroit and build upon the great momentum that we have with the addition of this Rivertown market. Detroit is a food desert, so to know that we're going to have some good food in this neighborhood, good fresh produce, good fresh meat, I'm excited. I don't know about you, but I'm excited. So I just want to say thank you, thank you, and thank you for bringing this project, for bringing this right here, right here on Jefferson in the city of Detroit. And of course, uh, <laughs> That is the city council president, Brenda Jones, and you can genuinely sense in her excitement that this is a major shift for this neighborhood, for this area, changing the way people live in this area, giving more reason for people to come and live in downtown Detroit. And so it's a big sea change and one that uh, they're very happy to see here. Reporting live on the east side, Rod Maloney, Local 4. Yeah, it's very, very exciting, Rod. Thank you.